What's going on everyone? It's John from 16 Views, and I'm assuming you clicked on this video because you accidentally deleted a file off an SD card or your computer, and then you frantically searched the web on how to recover the files, and then you clicked on this video because you saw the words free and easy. Well, the method I'm going to show you is free and easy, and let's get right into it. I know how stressful this can be. The whole reason I did this video is because just a few days ago I accidentally deleted like 15 gigabytes of drone footage that I had, and I just flipped out and it took me like an hour to recover. And so now I'm kind of making this video so you guys don't have to spend an hour. You don't have to worry. It's all going to be okay. First off, if you just deleted something that was already on your computer, just go over to the trash bin and then all of your recently deleted files will be right there. So that's super easy. But I'm assuming that most people who clicked on this video probably deleted something off either an SD card or some other external storage like that. One thing I learned from my whole deleting drone footage debacle was that when you delete something off an SD card, it doesn't actually delete it fully. It removes it from being shown in files, but it keeps it on the SD card until storage space begins to fill up again on that SD card and then it deletes the files permanently. So it has more space to write the things that you're currently recording or the files that you're dragging over or anything like that. As long as you haven't used the SD card and like filled up the entire storage since you deleted the files, and most people probably wouldn't like wait that long before trying to figure out how to get the files back, you're gonna be completely fine. To recover the deleted files, you're gonna have to download a program that can go through the SD card and extract the files that have kind of been hidden away on the SD card. There are a ton of applications that do this, but the one that I settled on is called Recover. Um, the link will be in the description when, if you want to like download it because I'll be doing the whole tutorial using Recover. But the reason I settled on this one is because all the others I tried, the free version limited you on how much data you could recover. So most of them had a limit of 500 megabytes, which was completely useless to me because I had 15 gigabytes. Recover lets you recover an unlimited amount of data from an SD card for free. The first thing you want to do is just go download the program Recover, and again, the link for that is in the description. I already have it downloaded, but you just go download it and, you know, let allow the permissions or whatever it tells you to do. Open the program, and then you want to then plug in whatever SD card or USB drive you're trying to recover files from. So I'm going to plug in my SD card that I've just recently just deleted some files from that I don't really need just for the purpose of this tutorial. Okay, so you open Recover, you click Next, uh, keep the file type on all files just so it searches for all files, so whatever you're looking for it'll show up. Then I click Next. And in this case, if you know exactly where the files are, like they're on the SD card or they're on the hard drive or anything like that, go to In Specific Location, Browse, and then select the drive that you're trying to recover the files from. So in this case, it's, for me, USB drive G. You click OK, so now it knows where to look for the files. If you don't know where the files are, you can select it so it's I'm not sure and it'll search everywhere on the computer, but this just makes it easier and it'll be quicker because it's searching the exact place where you know the files are. So you select the drive, then you'll click next, and then start, and it'll just load all the files there. And so you can see these are all the files that I deleted but now are back. And then you can just select the ones you want to recover. So I want, I'm just going to say I want all of them. And then you just go over here, click recover, and then just select a place where you want the files to then be downloaded. So I'm just going to go to pictures and camera roll on my computer, click OK, and then it'll just transfer all of those files over to my computer and they're all recovered. And they're all going to be the exact same quality, they're all going to be the same file type, like everything will be OK. So yeah, it's, it's really that simple, like don't worry, it's all going to be OK, it literally took, it takes like three or four minutes. If this video helped you get your files back, drop a like on this video so it can help more people find it and get their files back too that they deleted. Uh, if you really liked it, you know, think about subscribing or anything. This is John from 16 Views. See ya.